Hi guys, I am back with another video. I am super excited to film this. It's kind of a spur of the moment type of thing, but I got something in the mail yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday. And I want to show it to you guys on camera because I just feel like pictures don't do these things justice. It's stickers. This is the first time I've ordered from Sticky and I am ready to order again. I just love everything that they have on their website. So Sticky is a subscription for stickers. They do have three different styles of stickers that you can subscribe to and that is retro which is what I'm going to subscribe to. I already did. What am I kidding? They have the cute pack and then they have the pop pack they are ten dollars a month which is pretty affordable and shipping to the u.s it's only a dollar so you pay eleven dollars a month for cute stuff i had to do it but they also ship to canada that is a dollar 75 for shipping and then international is two dollars and fifty cents i love this thing already so much <laughs> Also, so this video isn't just about stickers, I wanted to do a flip through of my journal. The reason why I bought these stickers is because I'm working on this bad boy right now. I've been doing like a spread a day. It just depends on what I'm in the mood to document that day. There's no really rhyme or reason to how I'm doing this journal. So yeah, I wanted to flip through this little guy, what I have done so far. Some of these do contain personal information so I'm not gonna show you guys those spreads but I'm pretty proud of how this is going. As you can see I have that much done. This is all that I have left to do. I'm gonna show you guys all the stickers that I got and then at the end I'll do a quick little flip through. If you missed out on a certain pack a certain month you can buy it on their shop. I mean until supplies last. I was gonna get their once upon a time pack and the other one was for like a gothic library pack but at the time of checking out the gothic library had sold out but it's okay it worked out because when I went to go check out what that month had they had like the individual items on their shop so I didn't miss out on the ones that I wanted. So yeah, you can just shop the individual items or whatever packs they have from past boxes. We're getting, we're getting into the envelope. The thing that I love is that your pack comes in, oh my God, that is annoying. One of these envelopes that you can just stick into a binder. I need a sticker binder now. Every month they send you, it's not just stickers. I noticed that they do send you a notepad. This is the Once Upon a Time pack. It comes with this notepad, ballerina popping out of a portrait. In the back, I'm gonna reach in. There is this postcard, so beautiful. And then this other one, there's these stamps that are beautiful and gorgeous there's mermaids which i am all about also some dome stickers and then there's some stickers that have like castles on them each of these strips costs 275 individually the packs themselves are 15.99 if you get them from their shop but this is basically what you get for $11 a month if you subscribe to them. I do have a referral link um, that they gave me when I subscribed. So that's going to be below if you guys want to check them out. This is one of my favorites. The fox, the cat. I am loving this one so much. I can't get over this one. It is beautiful. It's just mirrors and frames. And then we have some books which... I'm pretty excited about and then I think these are just like I'm trying to find like a theme for this but it's just like random stuff now we're going into the little pockets comes in the little plastic bag they're just individual stickers Ooh, that is so pretty this one right here yeah so it's a lot of different stickers Wow, I can't get over these. I haven't gone through them myself. I was waiting for this video. We're going into the last little pocket. This has two stickers on it with the theme for that month. It says, get excited for sticky storage. Use one theme sticker at the bottom right corner 
and use the other one however you wish so so you know which pack is which it's pretty cool upgrade your sticky storage to create a collection by inserting into any standard a5 six hole binder sticky folio available oh they also have the binders available at the shop that's pretty cool so yeah that was the once upon a time pack i'm so excited about it but besides that i did get some individual items which come in this beautiful envelope Ugh. I need to find a way to display this because it's so gorgeous. Oh yeah, so I got <laughs> two extras because I know I'm going to be using these a lot. I got two extras of these. I'm just so in love with these and even know where this thing was my entire life. <laughs> This is one of the things I bought before it got sold out. I got the last one, but it is eyeballs. I love eyeballs. So I am going to show you guys these against this one because they are transparent and they are chandeliers. I am obsessed with them. I want to get like five more of these because I know I am going to run through them super quickly. And then we have a spread with skulls. Yeah, I got it because of the schools and then because of the books that it has. Then I also got this one with more schools and more books. This is another transparent one and it's just like vintage stuff. And the last one that I bought is this witchy one. I mainly got it because of this guy right here. Yeah, I have to have all the animal schools and skeletons ever. These are gorgeous i kind of don't even want to use them because they are so beautiful but i have to i have to i have to or else <laughs> what am i doing okay so next up i'm gonna flip through this little guy really quick in the front here i have a ouija board fiend sticker and then a ouija board planchette i got these stickers i want to say etsy so when i open this i have another Ouija board sticker. I am gonna decorate this someday, but not today. So this is the title page I'm calling it. There's just a poison sticker, a spider, the book of script because I don't like using my name on stuff. And then a ghost's postcard. This is one of my absolute favorite spreads and that is my TBR spread. I did make this book myself. I don't know, remember how I did it, but yeah, I made a little book out of this paper with books that I want to read. Yeah, and I put it just in this envelope, peeking out. I am super, super proud of this one. It's so cute. This is one of the other ones that I am super proud of. It's so cool, but I never really go to the circus, so I don't know what I'm going to put on here. Maybe, I don't know, pictures of books about the circus we'll see and then here i'll show you guys this one this is from an ice cream date i also do memories on this this is like an ice cream date that i went with my friend Brittany. i stole one of their business cards <laughs> that they just had at the register i had to paint the pages with like the same colors as the sprinkles this is another one of my favorites which is my faves spread don't know which months i'm gonna do on this maybe may maybe i don't know but the the bubbles is where I'm gonna write down all of my favorites for that month. Okay, so this is a spread where I keep myself accountable with my reading. I've been doing pretty good lately. My slump is fading little by little. I'm kind of there but as you can see I read most of the week. But this is the books that I got in the month of February and in the month of March. I still have to film that video in a few months but sneak peek these are the books that i read in the month of january and it was only three <laughs> in the month of february i only read one book it's pretty sad too but it's okay because in march i read eight books halloween inspired spread obviously it has some lyrics to some of my favorite songs in this spread i kind of messed up because <laughs> you can't really see the words. This is my spread that I dedicated to one of my favorite songs of all time, The Knife by Kyla LaGrange. I should have written them in white but I didn't really want to go over everything again so I'm just leaving it. It's fine. Nobody needs to read it. <laughs> this is another random. I don't really know what I had in mind here but it is what it is. 
So this is one of the personal ones, but I still want to show you guys because I'm pretty proud of it. I'm pretty proud of how my mermaid came out. But I'll end this with the spread that I'm working on today, and that is a calendar for May. I am really loving this color scheme and how this is coming out. I do know already off the bat that I'm going to use one of those chandelier stickers for this. This is like, I don't know, one of the prettiest things I've ever done. And I'm pretty proud of it. Yeah, this is coming apart. <sighs> I'm going to have to glue it on somehow again because, yeah, this just popped right out. That is it for this video. It's kind of random, kind of, I don't know, all over the place. But I really wanted to show you guys my stickers and what I've been working on lately. This has been helping with my mental health a lot. I actually look forward to being in my room so I can create ate something yeah that is it i hope you guys enjoyed this video forgot to mention that i got this journal at killstar they have a few different designs there let me know if you like stickers collecting stickers or if you plan on getting any but do let me know what you guys have been doing to keep saying yourselves i'm gonna go back to my journal and listening to scary stories on youtube that's basically all i've been doing lately and i scare myself to death with those videos but i can't stop anyway that is it for this video and i'll see you guys next time bye